Thailand outlook. สวัสดีครับ and welcome to another edition of Thailand Outlook, your radio magazine program broadcasting every Monday to Friday from 6:45 onward. I'm Paul r u c h o p a k a n and I'm Wanachai Jitiwong. Today we will be talking about the vocational education in Thailand 4.0, the 21st century skills that Thai younger generation need for their success in the information age, and the latest cabinet approval to raise motorway toll. As we know, the digital technology in these days has a profound influence across the business world. Entrepreneurs have become aware of the need to adapt to fast-changing digital trends that may affect their business practices. But in other sectors like education, the, we we can see the new curriculum, so new uh, majors of study uh, that has focused more on you know how to develop their students in terms of technological skills or how to uh, bring the new set of skills or new set of abilities to the student in order for them to. To succeed in the 21st century, so we, we have heard uh, quite often about the 21st century skills for the Thai educational systems nowadays uh, that uh, has placed much importance on technology, innovation, and any other things that uh, that are useful for for younger generations to make use of in order for them to you know to overcome the new trends of having careers to be wise. In making use of social media or internet in their careers or in their education, so I think this is the irresistible trend that uh, our Thai younger generations um, have to care for, so that uh, they can be better prepared for the 21st century's jobs markets and many other opportunities. Yes, absolutely. I think it's uh, very important to take advantage of the new technological advances available to us to help enhance the educational and academic experience and better prepare the youth of today for the world of tomorrow. And in doing so, further propel the kingdom into the 21st century, as you said. We we have uh, actually the initiatives of the Thailand for p i o where the. Younger generations are encouraged to um, develop their communication skill, interpersonal skills, and technological skills. The set of skills that are important for their future, and definitely the job markets that offer a new prospects will include these kind of skills as a very very important elements for um, human resources development uh, in the future. Absolutely, and as the world becomes more interconnected, so too does the need for those of us living in it and the youth growing up in it to prepare ourselves for a more globalized society, if you will. Thailand 4.0 is the government's central economic development plan. The goal is for Thailand to escape the middle income trap by finding a new engine of growth based on innovation and technology. Thailand 4.0 seeks for smart farmers to use technology to add value to their products, smart SMEs to utilize innovations for better business, and smart workers to be skilled and highly productive. Education Minister Dr. t i r a k i y a t j a r o n s e t a s i n discussed vocational education 4.0, which has actively promoted technology skills for vocational students to satisfy the labor market of the 21st century. We now we have to have the infrastructure, the internet, which I'm now reforming, big time. Did you hear what I said? Yeah, right. How much in the internet is costing the vocational people per month per school? 25,000 baht. Are you paying that much for your house? So what is going on? Unless we sort this out, we cannot have 4.0. The infrastructure 4.0 has to be there, stable, secure, efficient. That's it. The little way to lay the foundation. That's why I'm reforming the high-speed internet access to all students in Thailand, not only vocational students. Everybody should have access to. The most efficient internet services we can have, given our budget. That's the point of view of education ministers. And let's hear about the perspective from younger generations, Miss Apita Tanin and Pim Lapat Sukbanjong, who have been studying 
at School of Global Studies and Social Entrepreneurship at t h o m a s a t University, speaking about the 21st century skills in particular that they find important in this information age. And we also study in the 21st century skill, which is very important in the future. For um, what she said about 21st century skill, 21st century is like the century with. Um, globalization, like really high globalization, and then um, the technology and everything is coming um, to replace like human and stuff. But then, um, 21st century skill is skill for um, people for the um, the workforce to gain beyond beyond that technology. For example, um, ability to like um, talk with other people, creativity, and something like that. Mm -hmm. I think uh, as Speaking speaking skill is very important in the future. When you work, you know the communication. If if you have ability to communication effectively, this is very great skill to to have in the future. And that's what has been said from two students who see several opportunities arising for those who own two particular skills: language skills and communication skills. Thailand outlook. The cabinet has resolved to approve an increase to the collection of toll fees on the Bangkok Chonburi Pathia motorway. According to the minister attached to the prime minister's office, the cabinet this week greenlit a draft ministerial regulation that determines new toll rates for motorists using Highway Number no. Seven, also known as the Bangkok Chonburi Pathia motorway. Set to be effective this coming April 19th, the new regulation will increase the number of toll stations to nine, which will in turn raise the maximum toll rates for travelers traveling between Bangkok to Pattaya from 60 baht to 105 baht for personal vehicles, while six-wheel trucks will be charged a maximum of 170 baht. Big trucks with more than six wheels will be charged a maximum of 245 baht per trip. That was another edition of Thailand Outlook here on Radio Thailand. We hope you enjoyed your time here with us and have a safe drive home if you're still on the road. สวัสดีครับ Thailand Outlook.